Okay, today what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to do a reveal. I'm going to get rid of the rubber band from off here so I don't have the girdling. And we're going to take a look at what's going on. That has really, really grown for the first year. I just did this uh, oh, around the 16th of May. Even got a flower set in there. That's brand new growth. Now this graft right here was an inlay graft. Basically, bark inlay. I've been calling them inlays when I put them on limbs like this just to see if they would take, and they took. I've done two of them. And got a little tiny piece of bamboo to put back behind there to stabilize this and keep it locked into the limb just in case wind comes around. Put this in my pocket. <coughs> <clears throat> now, what I'm going to do is, is gently take the rubber band off and the parafilm, and we'll have a very close look at what's going on. Let's see if I'm able to pull this off this way. That rubber band is in there tightly, which is why I wanted it to be tight. Now then. It hasn't been completely two months since I've done that. And already, you could see, put my finger, my hand up there, you could see the girdling that was happening. That rubber band was holding on to that extremely tight. Now, put some fresh parafilm on there and try to keep that covered up, keep it fresh. Last night I came out here and I did that one over there and the parafilm kept snapping on me. It's like it didn't want to stretch. So far so good. <laughs> Okay, now let's get in here and I'm going to wrap parafilm across the top right here. When I, when I did that graft, I left the slope coming down this way for water run off it. Man, that's almost completely around the end of that stem that I cut. So. Let's go ahead and, well, come on, parafilm. Okay, while I got that on there, I'm going to wrap it all up with the stick on it. Some more parafilm. 
<clears throat> I'm really, really surprised at how well that did. Now I'm going to come up here and start my wrap. Because like I said, I want that to be secured. I'm even going to do some more parafilm. Is this the right way of doing things? I don't know. It's just my experimentation. I just want to make sure that that's braced up. And that's the reason why I did with the, with the little bamboo stick to hold it in place. Give it more support. Until it completely heals. And actually probably don't need it other than to cover up this down here and I'm wrapping it up tightly but not as tightly as I would when I first graphed, I just want that parafilm to hold right there. There you have it. Inlay, bark inlay graft. This was a sunflower that I had grafted last year on the 23rd of May. And the other side took very well. Now we're working on this side to try to bring more balance to the tree. And it's looking like it's going to work out pretty good. Every bit of that is sunflower. There is nothing coming off that rootstock at all. All the growth you see in this tree is from grafted material. And it's all sunflower. Every scion I grafted into here was a sunflower scion. Just something that I wanted to share. My name's Jim. If you like what you see, subscribe. Don't forget to click on that bell for notifications. Y'all have a God-blessed day.